if I was gonna be a a, a movie star, I, I think I would be uh, myself. <laughs> I don't really, I really don't think I'd want to be somebody else. Uh, I, you know, I would need some practice. I, w I would need some practice. Uh, you know, because you see this like, uh, uh, I'm not quite relaxed. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm, I'm a little bit, a little bit, a little bit like a, a, a half step. It's like you, you see somebody who dances, but they're like, eh, 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 eh. That's, that's me all the time. That is me all the time. But, uh, see, even now, I don't even know what to talk about. I'm like, oh my god, what am I going to say? Oh, I got too much, I got too much weight on my shoulders. I got too much weight on my shoulders and it's like, I'm, I'm, I'm like, I think that's what it means to be depressed, right? To be pushed down, I believe is what depressed actually means. Like if you depress the key on the keyboard, it means to push it down, right? So to be depressed means to be pushed down. And it's like I got I got too many What is it that that, that pushes me down? It's it's this it's this notion that that I have to make other people happy. That that I have to that I have to be acceptable to other people. That I have to, if I'm going to be a movie star, that I have to, that I have to, I have to, I have to be pleasing. I have to be, I have to be likable. Sometimes I feel sorry for, for, for the people who play bad guys in movies. You ever heard that, that a lot of dentists are depressed? That there are higher rates of depression among dentists than like a lot of other professions, and that's because people go to to visit them. They typically don't want to be there, and so the over time that that you know it kind of affect it affects the dentist as it's like people are saying to them, "I don't like you." Uh, the fact that they're there to get their teeth cleaned is, you know, I'm sure the dentists are aware that that's part of it, but, you know, people don't always, it's hard to make that distinction sometimes. Sometimes, <sighs> I mean, oh, I feel so pretty with the wig on, in the makeup, in the in the hormones too. The hormones are doing a really good job of. Making me look like a woman. Don't you think? Don't you think? I think it's it's good to make videos where I just kind of just kind of let it out. Uh, if I think too much about what I'm gonna say, it just seems to depress me. And I mean, like it's pushing down on my back. I, I'm like, out, get off my back. Oh. Uh. <sighs> yeah too much for me there is I think there has been a little bit too much of that okay. lately too many too many messages from the universe that that I'm not 
that I'm not lovable, that I'm not likable. Uh, the big one, of course, is the family. Uh, then there are other ones, uh, like the woman that I'm in love with, who doesn't even talk to me now. Uh, that's a big one. A uh, friend of mine, maybe not really, maybe I shouldn't call him a friend. We were, we went to high school together. Uh, when I say I shouldn't call him a friend, that's just because I haven't been in touch with him for uh, 30 years. Yeah, almost 30 years. It's 29 years since I graduated high school. And, uh, so I haven't been in touch with them since I left. And I sent him a friend request the other day on Facebook. And then he accepted the friend request, but then when I messaged him and said, How are you? Or how have you been? Or something like that. He just never responded to it. And, uh... That was significant because... One of the reasons why I sent him the friend request in the first place was because... it he of all people in my life appears in my dreams probably more than anybody else Ex maybe the woman that i'm in love with i think they're kind of uh in competition you might say not really in competition maybe that's not a good way to put it but as far as like who i who who has appeared to me in my dreams the most often uh and when i say appeared that's basically what i mean they just show up it's kind of like hi you know, it's good to see you. <laughs> That's pretty much how it goes. Uh, so that that was, I mean, that was kind of it. I mean, it was like this this guy just keeps popping up in my dreams just just to say hi. And I thought, you know what? Maybe I'll just send him a friend request. See see what's going on. Maybe maybe he has dreams about me, or I don't know. I really don't know why that is. And he's not somebody that I that I fantasize about sexually or anything like that. So I'm not sure what that what that's about. Even the dreams are not sexual. Uh, but So yeah, so a good deal of rejection. Uh, uh, it is like a weight. It's like a weight. It's like oh, I, I need. I feel like I need to. Uh, But, but but there's that part of me. That part of me that says, "You could be a movie star. You could be you could be a rock star. You have the potential. You've just been convinced that you're a loser <laughs> for for too many years." I don't think it would be ironic. I think some people might find it ironic if I, as I go through this transition, if I start to become, you know, to the point where I'm like pretty much a woman all the time. When I say pretty much, uh, I don't know. People, I don't know what pe what people would count me as like right now. Like I'm some kind of androgen right some kind of hermaphrodite looking thing looks like i'm probably half man half woman maybe uh but if i kind of go in that direction what, what is it 
18 months, 16 months I think I've been on HRT. <sighs> Wait, I feel it on my neck. It's like it's literally on my shoulders. I actually feel it like right here on my neck. It's just like, ugh. Uh, the weight, the, the, the need to be acceptable, I need to be socially acceptable in order, in order, in order to make it in this world. I can't make it in this world if I'm not socially acceptable. If I'm a monster, I'll, I'll, I'll be doomed to be the hunch, if I'm the hunchback of Notre Dame, Notre Dame, is it Notre Dame, the hunchback of Notre Dame, I think. Uh, that I'm doomed. I'll have to hide for the rest of my life. I'll have to be. I'll have to become a witch, and live out in the woods in my hut, my my straw thatched roof hut, with my with all my little uh, potions and, and herbal. Uh, uh, what, what do you call those plants? The big squash looking things. The 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 gourds. The gourds. Am I a bimbo? Uh, I have to be a witch. Living out in the woods. Scaring people off when they come nearby. Making all kinds of noises. and I'm like, I'll cast spells on you. I'll cast spells on you and make turn you into a toad. And people will say, oh no. Nobody believes in magic anymore, you don't fucking bitch. Can't scare us with that shit. <laughs> uh, uh. The weight of the world is on my shoulders. The weight of the world is on my shoulders. The weight of the world is on my shoulders. But it is it's not the it's not the world. It's it's the it's my need to be I I need to be part of you, world. I need to be a part of you. I I need I need to be we need to we need to be in a cooperative state. We need, we need to, to be agreeable with each other and cooperate and, and work like a machine and otherwise I can't be happy if I'm in this constant like, I, I don't know if you like me world, I don't know if I fit here, I, I can't live, I can't live like that. I have to be, I have to be a winner and I have to be, I have to know that I have value to society. I have to know that I have value to society. You, you have to, you have to show me that I have value, society, and show me that I have that I have value. Do you do you think that uh, people's people make an internal an internal connection between their income and their their value as a human being? If you don't make a lot of money, does that does that mean you don't have much value as a human being? And if you make a shit ton of money, does that mean you have more value as a human being? Is Elon Musk more valuable as a human being than me? And people will say, well, he's worth more. Right? He's worth more. It, there, there comes, there comes, here comes the rain again. He's worth more. He's worth more. <sighs> He's worth more money. He's worth more money. That means he's worth more. People say, how much is he worth? How much is Elon Musk worth? If I Google how much is Elon Musk worth, what what is Google going to say? Is, gonna, is Google going to say... His value cannot be put into numbers. Or is Google going to say he's worth $2 billion? I don't know what it is. $2 billion? Is it $2 billion? $12 billion? I don't know what it is. What is, her, what is Oprah's net worth? 
she's she's in this she's invaluable she's a human being all human beings are invaluable that's not true nobody actually believes that if people actually believed that there wouldn't be homeless people would they would there if I say would they does that does that mean I have no value I'm less valuable to society because I said would they instead of would there <sighs> I'm less valuable to society because I can hardly even talk why is it so difficult for me to goddamn talk why is it so difficult for me to express myself and say ah Well, I'm scared to make a video without a wig on. I mean, that's that's proof that I'm a loser, right? I don't want to make a video without a wig on. I'd run out to the hills and bury my head in the sand. It's not funny. It's depressing. Alright, I'm going to stop there because i got other shit to do.